the University of Warwick is a modern campus university located in the West Midlands, about an hour away from London by train and 20 minutes from Coventry City by bus. The university features some of the top-rated departments in the country, including the Warwick Economics Department, the Warwick Law School, and the Warwick Business School. Students enjoy world-class teaching facilities as well as self-study areas, including a five-story library and annex. The campus itself is really quite beautiful and close to nature, and includes many sports and recreational facilities, a supermarket, as well as religious and social support services, among other things. The Students' Union is there to cater to students' needs, providing a variety of support services, numerous entertainment options, and FMB outlets. Warwick is also well known for having a large number of clubs and societies for students to join, including our very own Singapore Society, where we organise everything from socials to sports activities to make you feel at home. Now let's see what some of your seniors have to say about staying on campus. Uh, basically, the rooms in Westwood are pretty spacious compared to like um, like the roots rooms, and like all of the rooms have like a sink with it. Um, the rooms are a bit smaller than the rest of the accommodation on campus, but it's also one of the cheapest on campus. But I'm only paying ninety one pounds um per week. Oh, it's true. Okay, well, the room itself is decent size, but not as big as West Square, but it's comfortable living space, I would say. The Blue Bell rooms are very big, they're very spacious. We have a double bed, and there's an ensuite toilet. We have everything in this flat and a non-suite toilet, including a bathtub. Um, although Sherborne is the latest that it was built, uh, it's not the biggest. In the end, Bluebell is still bigger than Sherborne. Like, um, the kitchens are pretty nice because like, they just renovated last year, and so it's pretty spacious. Like, we have, um, like a uh, common area on the ground floor and then like if nothing to do you can just go there and like you know hang out with the rice and just like talk you rarely have to wait for your turn to use the showers or the baths or even the toilets because it's like 14 people to three showers and four toilets some people might find it a bit icky to share your bathrooms with other people and i and i thought that was a bit disgusting also when i first came here but after a while, I actually got used to it and the toilets here are cleaned quite regularly. They're cleaned about like twice a week. It's a luxury, your unseat toilets are a luxury. They even replenish your toilet rolls and clean your toilet for you. Just, just saying. <laughs> My kitchen is decent, but nobody really hangs out in the kitchen because uh, it's inconvenient because like, the stove and the dining areas are in the same place, so it gets in the way. So we have like a public laundrette and drying facilities downstairs. And the kitchens are very, very spacious and clean and the light just comes in from a window and like just brightens up the whole kitchen, so it's a very nice place. Um, also, we have a social space downstairs for you to use if you want to like organise parties or whatever. Okay. There are eight, eight of us sharing a kitchen and the kitchen, is big, the kitchen is big enough to accommodate all of us. Um, generally, the kitchen is the largest of all kitchens in the entire school. The toilets, uh, they're not as big as the Bluebell ones, but they'll, they'll be just fine. Oh, the atmosphere is really nice because unlike Bluebell or Sherburn, for example, everything is open so you get to know everyone from your level. Um, it can be a little bit noisy, um, but it depends on the room you get and which floor you're on. And I'm placed on the top floor, which is much quieter than um, a lot of the other places in Roots. Um... I live on the top floor so it's very quiet. Generally the surrounding area is also quiet so it's good for studies, although when people walk in the hallway and talk, you can't hear them. Um, Blue Bell is situated in a corner of the campus so it's pretty quiet and very um, nice for studying and very nice for just like staying in your room and doing things you like. 
if you want to seek um, quietness and peace, I'll recommend Heron Bank. It's situated next to uh, the lake as well, and there are many ducks, geese, and swans frolicking around the lakes. If people do their partying, they do it on the central campus. By the time they get here, they're either sober enough or they're passed out, so it's not that noisy when you compare it to like bluebell or roots. But the community itself, uh, it's enough for you to get you through your days. In fact, it is uh, it's very family-like atmosphere here, I would say. But, but every flat it has has a difference, so you don't take my word for it. So it takes about like 20 minutes for me to walk from um, Westwood to Central Campus, which is a bit long, but some of the people here, they actually bought a bike, so it takes them about 5 minutes to just cycle there. It's quite good in the sense that it's just next to Tesco, and like, um, it's very convenient, especially when you do weekly grocery shopping. Oh, Roots, Roots probably has the best location. It's right next to the Student Union building, and it's like a 10 minute walk away from main campus where all the lecture theatres are, so I think it is definitely way more accessible than like Chauvin. 15 minutes walk, 10 minutes walk is really fine. Only only, only presents a problem when you're carrying groceries back. There are people who like uh, order online delivery from Tesco, which is uh, efficient as well. So it depends on what's your style. Oh, it's great, man. You feel so at ease here because there's no one around, really. If you if you're a very sociable person, I think you like roots a lot because there's opportunities to make new friends, to go on activities to them. But uh, it's also it can also be a very conducive environment. Like if you live on the higher levels, yeah. Um, there's a gas stove in the kitchen, which I highly advocate. So if you're a cooking enthusiast, you would appreciate the effect. For six pounds more, you get Arthur Vic, which has an in-house lingerie, a common room, and twice the size of a kitchen, and you get double the fridge space. So. It's a very, very nice place. So, um, it's a very comfortable and cozy environment. And if you plan not to get a bicycle, it's still possible. You just have to work, wake up a bit earlier for your 9am lectures. Staying on campus, you should take advantage of the many sports and recreational activities available. Let's see what some of your seniors have been doing with their time. Uh, I'm from Breakdance. Warwick Finance Society. Avoid Mountains. PP Society. London and Ballroom. Alright Asia Career Society Kali Jikindo The Polyphonics Warwick Snow Econ Society Law Society Salsa Warwick Glee Skydiving Classical and Modern Dance Climbing Malaysian Society Frisbee Band Sock Sing Sock Sing Sock And of course Warwick Singapore Society <laughs> Do join the sports club because the sports clubs here are very active and um, you get to go to a lot of different places and try a lot of new things and meet new people. So yeah, definitely do join a sports club. I think they should adopt the open mindset, as cliche as that sounds. Because uh, Warwick is quite an isolated campus, life on campus is really what you make of it. Just make time for yourself and for your studies. The relationships with people and the friends around you are very important because there's nothing much else to do as compared to London. And that would just help to make your life in Warwick a lot, a lot more enjoyable. Knowing people, talking to people and travelling are the easiest way for you to discover who you are and who you want to be. So create your own opportunities, participate in events and make the most out of your time here. Hi, my name is Wei Ming. Hi, my name is Audrey. Hi, my name is Abel. Hi, I'm Yu. Hi, I'm Dominic. Hi, I'm Elena. Hi, my name is Lionel. Hi, my name is Charlene. Hi, I'm Terence. Hi, my name is Jitian. Hi, my name is Lina. Hi, I'm Chunhua. Hi, my name is Shen Cheng. I hope to see you soon. Hope to see you guys soon. I hope to see you guys soon. I hope to see you soon. I hope to see you soon. I hope to see you soon. Well, I hope to see you soon. I hope to see you soon. I hear babies cry. I watch them blow. They learn.